kiss. This one in particular feels, um, you know, just that much more special being like my home show. Uh, I had the opportunity this prep as well to go down to my coach Cameron's house um, for a week, uh, at two weeks out. So we were just down there training and just living the bodybuilding lifestyle. And we just got back up here um, a couple days ago to finish off the prep. Having like my family, um, you know, live it with me. I don't take that for granted at all either. Like there's so many challenges that pop up through like just day to day, of, like low energy and like trying to manage so many different things. Like Sarah stepped up to the plate huge to be able to like help run the business essentially while I was away in Atlanta. Like she's taking care of Walker. Um, it's those types of like sacrifices that I'm like, you know, I gotta make this worthwhile. Side chest. Your, your rear double definitely looks full. Like your glutes are sharper than this morning. Sharper? Yeah. Yeah, it's just sort of the last, I guess, tough day. Like, we just string some depletion days together. Um, today's my last workout. Uh, or full workout anyway at Pure Muscles. So we're going to be doing a little bit of a push day uh, today. And then tomorrow is just a pump to move some food around as we start to load up. a little lower than it typically would be. I'm a little bit more depleted, um, but that's all sort of part of the process to being able to, to fill out and to display like a really, you know, kind of better pop to the muscle and then and dry out and kind of have that, uh, that you know, peak condition um, that you need to at this level. When I did the 2022 uh, Mr. Olympia, I was 217 waking up in the morning for that competition and I was 228 and a half this morning. So substantial difference. Um, you know, if you guys have already seen the posing videos, like everything's in. So it's not like I'm giving up condition to bring size. It's just we had an extended off season that was able to kind of build tissue and to be able to kind of hang on to it this whole prep and probably honestly grow a little bit through prep. Cameron's been a huge piece. Like we got together for a full off season. And then the big kind of change in my mind, uh, bringing him into the picture was just his like attention to detail. And I'm the type of person where like, you know, I'm, if it's not like in my face day in, day out, like some things can slip through the cracks. And this prep is just like literally nothing has been missed. So 
he's been like extremely detail focused. Um, it's been an opportunity for me to learn like new methods again and, and to get excited about bodybuilding. Um, so just, this is really like unique scenario. I don't know many people that have spent the last two weeks of their prep day in day out with their coach. Like this just doesn't happen. So, uh, for him to be able to kind of facilitated that for me has been uh you know i gotta make this worthwhile like if i'm not 100 percent into this then like what am i doing right so it's like she's been able to to take the stress off my my plate here and for me not to be able to question like hey what am i doing like she fully gets it so the combination of just like family having cameron here um those have really been like the two biggest drivers to me for sure Drive, come on, good. Come on, Blake. Good. Let's go three. Good. 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 Come on, breathe. Good. Good, come on. Good. Two. Good. Come on. Up. Good. Oh, again. Come on. Up. Good. Oh. Control it down. Yeah, let's do a dip, tricep extension. That's fucking probably good. Touch up a little bit of delts. Touch up a little bit of delts, okay. <clears throat> ah. 
Everything's just like cracking in my shoulder socket. Yeah, it's coming down. <laughs> Alright guys, it's push day. Three days out from the Toronto Pro. You guys probably saw me at my absolute flattest. Tomorrow I get to pump some food into me and really fill the rig out and get ready to push it on Sunday, man. I can't wait. I hope you guys get to check it out. And uh, if you're down at the show, give me a shout. Peace.